All right, so I'm still in the middle of launch week for my book. I had the uh, launch party on um, Monday, and then all of this week I'm doing promotional things across all my social media and stuff like that, including a few giveaways. And I'm sorry if you are sick and tired of hearing about this now, but my new book's out now, Shine Manifesto. It's not what you're expecting. It's a little bit different. You might enjoy it, you might not like it. You won't know until you get stuck in. So. Download it now for, on Kindle, it's free. Get the app for your smartphone, for your tablet, for your Android, whatever it is, and um, download it for free, completely free all this week. And if you prefer paperback books, they're heavily reduced as well on Amazon. It's not hard to find, get onto Amazon, check it out. Um, but also, I yesterday finished uh, my meditation teacher training. So that's right, as well as doing this, um, I've also been training to be a meditation teacher and I finished that yesterday and last year I trained to be a life coach as well. I did some um, life coach training and uh, I said as part of the promotion week for this book that I would be giving away some coaching sessions. So um, I think sometimes we just need a bit of encouragement. So I, I would never have written my first book um, and it would have been very easy if I'd said to someone I'm writing a book. And they'd gone, yeah, good luck with that. It would have been enough to put me off doing it at all. You know what I mean? Because sometimes we get undermined so easily by people who, um, people who probably see the things we do as a kind of statement of the things they don't do, if you see what I mean. Um, it's very easy to get undermined. I, um, loads of things I've done where people have said, well, that's a bit ambitious, isn't it? And stuff like that and, and stuff like that just little throwaway comments when people say to you are you really doing that that can be enough to stop us doing those things that we feel self-conscious about but also they're the things that can help us move forward and um, get out of the ruts we're stuck in so um, you know sometimes all we need is a bit of encouragement someone to say yeah that's a good idea yes uh, well find out about it go and see what it takes to do that go and see what it takes to move one step closer to that dream you have or that goal you have or that target you have. So I am giving away a couple of coaching sessions um, and all you have to do is um, get in touch with me. I'm not going to give you the details because I'm not hard to track down. Just get in touch with me, send me a message and say that you're interested. Ideally I'd like to do these face to face but over the phone or by Skype is possible as well. So um, you know ideally it would be someone who lives nearby me so or London or um, East Sussex in the UK but get in touch I, I want to do this with two people and if you're particularly stuck or you don't know what you want or you want to be anywhere but where you are now reach out to me but bear in mind like it's like having a personal trainer I'm not gonna no coach can turn your life around it's like um, expecting uh, the personal trainer to do all the work out for you. you you have to put in the work and that is sometimes something that scares people off. They think, oh, well, I get a coach and my life's going to be perfect. But actually, the coach doesn't change your life. You're the person who changes your life. You've got to put the effort in. All the coach can do is suggest ways to um, you know, be better, feel better, take more action, and help you focus in on your goals, your targets, and possibly identify and try to overcome those negative self-beliefs and those, uh, those sabotaging narratives that you have inside your mind. So, so yeah, so hit me up if you want um, some coaching. There we go. All right, cheers for that.